Hey, it's Eric here with Cat Avenue. Today I'm going to be talking a little bit about rotating in uh, 3D. Once you understand the basic concepts of it, it's actually not that hard. Um, you just kind of have to be aware of the UCS icon here. And the UCS icon tells you where the Z is and where the X and the Y is. Think of the Z direction as a, a spinning top and it's pointing straight up and down. And then the X direction uh, as a top laying on its side, spinning uh, on its right side. And then the Y, just the opposite of that, spinning on its left side and pointing this way. So getting back to our drawing, if I were to draw just a simple circle, and I'm just going to place a circle anywhere, and put a, a one foot radius on it. If I were to want to flip this over on its left side, I would be rotating it on the Y axis, which would uh, flip it in the same uh, direction as the end of this pipe here. But if I were to rotate it in the X direction, I would flip it up towards myself and it would be uh, vertical to that piece of pipe. Let me show you what I mean by that. So let's type in RO for rotate and then choose rotate 3D. That's how you get to the 3D rotate. Um, select the circle. Um, here we have some options. We can rotate on the X axis, the Y axis, or the Z axis. Um, we can also specify uh, the point of um, rotation just by selecting two points, which I'll show you just in a bit. Let me just show you what would happen on the Y axis. So I selected that, I'm just gonna select the center and the angles is going to be the same here as this surface here pointed in the same direction. Let me undo that and again I'm going to go in rotate 3D select it and then choose the x-axis and the center in this example, I'm just basically rotating it so that it's pointing this way or on this axis here and show you an example on the on the pipe itself. So I've got this piece of pipe. Let me shade it. And uh, now I'm going to run that same command. But this time, I'm not even really going to think about the UCS too much. I know that my Z is pointed straight up and that's about all I really care about. Um, now I'm just going to select this and now I'm going to give it the access of the pipe itself. So from the center here pointed down somewhere down this direction here. So uh, I'll just place a point down here and then I'll just rotate it however I need. Now if I wanted to flip this up, I'll run that same command again, rotate 3D, select the entities press enter and then I'm going to be rotating it from this axis pointing it straight down this way and then rotating it up it's really as simple as that and if you're wondering what program I'm using I'm using a program just like AutoCAD which is called AbbeyCAD and AbbeyCAD is uh, probably about a quarter of the cost of AutoCAD and you're not obligated to uh, subscribe. You can buy the product and own it, unlike AutoCAD. And uh, feel free to reach out if you're interested in, in, in uh, something like that. So if you're uh, looking for a change, but you don't want to have to relearn CAD, uh, AbbeyCAD is a great uh, alternative because it's got everything that AutoCAD has and more. So the commands are all the same. So hopefully this video has been helpful and feel free to call me or email me. The number here is 888-271-7121. And uh, feel free to um, like this video and subscribe to get more CAD videos uh, for both AutoCAD and uh, AviCAD. Hope you have a great day and we'll see you in the next video.